When this lion was reunited with the man who raised her, the animal's reaction was jaw-dropping. In the YouTube clip, the adult-sized lioness is filmed prowling around her living space, seemingly in an excitable state. Spanish-speaking voices are heard approaching the gate of the enclosure, and we see the fearsome beast approach to investigate them. The lioness then paces from side to side and issues guttural noises. And when the gate is unlocked and opened, what happens next will have your jaw on the floor. Lionesses like her, however, typically inhabit Africa's savanna and grassland, although they may also take to bush and forest. And lions are unusually social compared to other species of cats as they group together in prides consisting of related females and offspring and a small number of adult males. In the wild, moreover, female lions like the one in the YouTube video typically hunt together, preying mostly on large mammals. Sadly, though, the lion as a species is under threat. Indeed, it's listed as vulnerable on the International Union for Conservation of Nature's Red List. That's been the case since the 1990s when the African lion population as a whole dropped by an alarming 43 percent. Furthermore, in 2016, the Animal Welfare Agency labeled the West African lion in particular as being critically endangered. And while experts are unable to indicate exactly why lion numbers have been falling, the finger of suspicion can definitely be pointed at the human race, with man's interference and developmental encroachment onto natural habitats being likely factors. So, in light of the lion's desperate plight and continuing decline, several organizations are taking action to prevent the very real threat of total extinction for the species. Zoos and sanctuaries across the world, for instance, have instigated concerted breeding programs for their lion populations. And there's one very special nonprofit organization in Mexico running its own initiative. The Black Jaguar White Tiger Foundation was set up to rescue large cats of all stripes and provide care for them. Based in Monterey in Mexico, the foundation also runs a breeding program to help reintroduce felines and some other endangered big cat species into the wild. This is where the YouTube lioness Kiera was taken when she was rescued as a cub. But in the event that Kiera had not been given a safe birth at Black Jaguar White Tiger, she may have instead faced a brutal and short life. After all, lions suffering from poor conditions in captivity usually meet early deaths. What's more, captive felines in the U.S. and Mexico can often also be used as photo props. To that end, they're often unsafely drugged in a stupor to render them unthreatening. Happily, however, Kiera did make it to the foundation where she was raised initially by a man called Adolfo and in the YouTube clip uploaded by Black Jaguar White Tiger in October 2015, we are shown the amazing scene when the pair are reunited. There we see the lioness waiting for him at the gate, recognizing his voice as he approaches. And what happens when Adolfo enters the enclosure is enough to leave you speechless. As Adolfo steps into Kara's pen, the lioness stalks him to its center before suddenly jumping up onto him. But this isn't an attack as she's absolutely delighted to see him. The reunited pair then fall to the ground where Kiera hugs Adolfo and they wrestle playfully. And Adolfo is so comfortable with the lioness's behavior that he even lets Kiera nuzzle his neck. She also lightly chews his knee through his jeans. This doesn't hurt Adolfo who continues petting the soppy big cat acting like an overgrown kitten. In fact, it's completely astonishing to see such an impressive predator behave so tamely. And Kiera seems to be totally adoring it as Adolfo strokes her like a household pet, a sign of how relaxed she is with him. It's also a sight that anyone who believes big cats are incapable of showing love and affection should see. As the heartwarming video draws to a close, though, Kiera takes a drink of water, perhaps thirsty from all the play fighting she's indulged in. But before the video ends, we see that Adolfo can even put his hands in Kiera's mouth without danger. A clear sign of the trust he has in her. Kira's relationship with Adolfo is a great illustration of what the Black Jaguar White Tiger Foundation can accomplish. The charity was founded by Edward Cerillo, a Mexican businessman living in Los Angeles. And in 2013, Cerillo went on a business trip to his home country that changed his life forever. During his stay, he was contacted by a cousin, a seasoned expert in working with animals, who lamented the sorry case of Cielo a baby black jaguar they'd come across. 
Surio's cousin then passed on the news that a pet store was attempting to buy Cielo and use the cub for photos. That story inspired Surio, who spent the time he should have been devoting to business on his trip, adopting the baby panther instead. And so the Black Jaguar White Tiger Foundation began. To date, the organization has rescued almost 300 big cats, including lions such as Kiera and panthers like Cielo, as well as leopards, tigers, lynx, servals, and pumas. In addition, the charity has given shelter to more than 60 canines, predominantly street dogs. But one of the foundation's key stated aims is the desire to raise awareness of the plight of big cats as such the organization addresses interested parties at conference events However, Surio hopes to utilize social media channels such as YouTube as he did with the Kiera clip to highlight the good work being done by the charity Ultimately the hope is in Surio's words that people will learn to fall in love with their planet and the Black Jaguar White Tiger Foundation certainly has some lofty ambitions. In addition to a government backed reintroduction scheme in Mexico, featuring native species such as ocelots, leopards, jaguars, and margays, the charity hopes to reintroduce captive lions to their traditional habitats in Africa and Asia. Sadly, though, the foundation has its work cut out here. After all, lions bred in captivity have an extremely difficult time adjusting to the wild and surviving. This is because they fail to learn species specific skills they would acquire from a pride such as how to hunt prey and raise cubs in addition They don't know the importance of avoiding human contact So although Kiera is playful and friendly and makes for a great video She would never survive in the wild and in particular It's her comfort with humans such as Adolfo that makes her vulnerable if the lioness met humans in the wild for example She might think them friendly by contrast, the humans may either attack, thinking her a threat, or capture her for their own nefarious ends. However, Black Jaguar, White Tiger's ambition is not just a futile dream. Indeed, a 2015 conservation triumph in the East African Republic of Rwanda may offer hope to Surio and his team. In that year, several lions from a South African game reserve were reintroduced to a Rwandan national park by a high-end safari operator. They were subsequently formed into a new artificial pride that observers hope will develop into a significant new population Rwanda National Park's lions were poisoned by cattle herdsmen following the Civil War genocide in 1994 in an attempt to protect their livestock However, this reintroduction brings hope for the vulnerable animals Indeed Peter Fernhead chief executive officer at African Parks Network in South Africa has told the Daily Mail it's a milestone conservation achievement for both the park and the country and it's great news for Kira's fellow lions too